Right now, there are more than 29,000 people living with Alzheimer's disease in Hawaii. Over the next five years, the Alzheimer's Foundation of America says that number is projected to increase by 25 percent. KITV Force Diana Ko tells us about a free conference coming up that hopes to help Alzheimer's patients and their caregivers with aging well. Education is such a tool of empowerment, and when you come, when it comes to Alzheimer's, like any situation, the more you know about it, the more you can address it. If you're dealing with Alzheimer's disease, if you just want to learn more about brain health, if you're caring for somebody with Alzheimer's, you know, we invite you to, uh, to register and take part. Describe what people can get. Right. So there's three different sessions. The first session is going to be just an overview of Alzheimer's disease, talk a little bit about some of the research that's going on. Uh, the second session is all about legal planning and getting different affairs in order in terms of uh, wills, medical directives, advanced directives, and just explain what those things are and why they're so vital for families affected by Alzheimer's disease. And then the third session is going to be about how do you make decisions for someone who is unable to make decisions for themselves and getting things like guardianships and you know different practical legal financial affairs in order um, so that you can execute a care plan. I suspect that the um, demand for each of the sessions changes based on where the patient is at their stage of Alzheimer's. Exactly. I mean, and, and there you hit the nail right on the head. It all depends on where they're at, but it's it's also the biggest thing we've found is just there is a thirst for information. How do you feel that the pandemic has affected um, people with Alzheimer's and caregivers? It's put an enormous strain on them. One of the biggest challenges is isolation in the sense that places where people used to be able to go, like respite care centers, adult daycare centers, uh, senior centers, a lot of those places closed or, and are still closed or have severely uh, limited hours because of the pandemic. Thank you very much. Chris Schneider, Director of Communications for the Alzheimer's Foundation of America, promoting your free educational conference uh, for Hawaii residents on February 25th. All the information on the Alzheimer, Alzheimer Foundation's website, which we will post a link to on KITV.com's Aging Well page. For Aging Well, I'm Diana Ko, KITV4 Island News.